Welcome to today's financial news. We'll discuss the latest big bet made by billionaire hedge fund manager Bill Ackman, known for his profitable trades. This time, he's taking aim at government bonds, specifically shorting 30-year treasury bonds. In between, please note that this video is for informational purposes only. All right, let's dive into the details. Bill Ackman is no stranger to making bold moves in the financial world. He gained fame when he questioned mortgage-backed collateral debt obligations before the Great Recession, leading him to short Municipal Bond Insurance Association, Inc., and make a handsome profit. He also became a household name when he shorted Herbalife, calling it a pyramid scheme, a trade that didn't go as planned. More recently, he made billions by protecting his stocks before the COVID-induced stock market decline in 2020, and then buying stocks at heavily discounted prices during the crisis. Now let's talk about Ackman's latest trade. On August 3rd, he disclosed on X, formerly Twitter, that he has taken a sizable bearish position on 30-year treasury bonds. He has several reasons for this bet. One reason for Ackman's bearish outlook is the ever-increasing government spending, which will likely lead to higher levels of debt issuance. With the current $32 trillion of debt and large deficits projected for the future, the supply of treasury bonds is expected to rise significantly. Simultaneously, the Federal Reserve's quantitative tightening, or QT, involves selling treasuries from its balance sheet to combat inflation, further increasing the supply. This combination of factors leads Ackman to believe that long bond yields are headed higher. Ackman also has concerns about inflation. While it has come down from its peak in 2022, he believes it will remain stubbornly higher than the Federal Reserve's 2% target. Structural changes, such as deglobalization, higher defense costs, the energy transition, growing entitlements, and increased bargaining power of workers all contribute to this view. Consequently, the Fed's stance of higher interest rates for longer may keep yields elevated beyond expectations. Moreover, global policy changes could impact Ackman's short position. Japan, the largest foreign owner of U.S. debt with $1.1 trillion, recently shifted its yield curve control, potentially making Japanese bonds more attractive relative to treasuries. Any change in demand for treasuries from Japan could act as a tailwind for higher yields. So, how high does Ackman think yields might go? He suggests that if long-term inflation remains at 3%, historical trends could push the 30-year treasury yield to around 5.5%. He even believes that this repricing could happen in a matter of weeks. To profit from the potential rise in rates, Ackman has opted to use options instead of directly shorting the 30-year treasury bond. By purchasing options, he limits his downside risk, which is an essential risk management tool according to him. In conclusion, billionaire hedge fund manager Bill Ackman's latest big bet involves shorting 30-year treasury bonds. He believes that increasing government debt issuance, coupled with quantitative tightening and persistent inflation, will drive yields higher. Ackman's track record of bold and profitable trades makes this one worth keeping an eye on in the financial markets. Thank you for tuning in to today's financial news. Be sure to stay informed and subscribe for more updates in the future. See you next time.